that make you hop and jump and get excited, maybe. But this is a simple message, a simple truth that's going to keep you going. Trust and obey. He's going to see you through. He's going to, whatever you into, he's going to bring you out. Because he's God. Look at this. 1 Corinthians 2 and 9. I'm through. You want to hear the howling and the screaming and the jumping over the benches. I don't have that. Now I can preach. Oh yeah. But I'm not going to do that. You want to learn this word. You want to become a living, walking epistle of this word. You want to be rooted and grounded in love. Come on. You want to have a seed of life. Come on. You want to die. The same person I'm seeing this year, I'm not going to see you like this next year. Come on. God's going to mightily use you and use your life for His glory. It's about Him. 1 Corinthians 2 and 9. Thank you, Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. First Corinthians 2 and 9. I'm through. I'm going to sit down. I have a word for somebody. 2 and 9. Because I can't see. First Corinthians 2 and 9. Amen. We come to church when we want. Right. We get blessed. Get a place at the shelter. Oh, I'm, oh yeah. I call you out. I don't care. I don't care if you don't like it. Amen. 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 Can't see you. Amen. Can't find you on Sunday. Hello, somebody. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Not don't even come and say thank you. People off the streets got houses, nice houses, furniture. Don't see them. Don't see them. Come on, somebody. That's why Jesus asked, what, what, didn't I send 10 men for so? Where the 10 at? Just one came back. But guess what? The one that came back, he said, I'm going to make you whole. The other ones, they heal, but they still got two, two fingers and one arm and the nose on. Amen? But you want to have everything. I'm going to make you whole. Why? Because you came back and said thank you. A lot of us don't even have enough good sense to say thank you. Appreciate First Corinthians. Two and nine. And I'm so glad my reward don't come from me. I'm so glad I don't have to wait on you to give me some money. I'm so glad he opens up avenues for me. Come on, somebody. He gives me ideas, creative ideas. Come on, somebody. Thank you, Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Lord. Because I belong to him. And no other. And he said, if you belong to me, I'm going to take care of you. I'm going to provide for you. I'm going to see for you when you can't see for yourself. I'm going to make a way out of no way for you. I'm going to open up a door for you. I'm going to bless you. <laughs> You're above all and not beneath. First Corinthians chapter four, verse chapter two, verse nine. But it, as it is written, eyes have not seen, nor ear heard, neither have entered into the heart of man the things which God has prepared for them that love Him. Close your Bibles and clap your hands. I'm through.